Hi friends, this is Madhu from Growbook. Today I am here to discuss my experience about driving to Cochin International Airport to fly out. Before entering into this video please subscribe to this channel to get regular videos from us. Driving to Cochin International Airport to fly out can be an exciting and nerve-wracking experience at the same time. Cochin International Airport is located in Nedumbasiri, about 30 kilometers northeast of Kochi, formerly known as Cochin, a major port city in the southwestern Indian state of Kerala. The drive to the airport from Kochi city center takes approximately 45 minutes to an hour, depending on traffic conditions. The route is well signposted, and there are several options for transportation. Once you arrive at the airport, you can proceed to the check-in counters to complete your formalities. It is recommended to arrive at least 2 to 3 hours before your scheduled flight departure time to allow sufficient time for security checks and boarding. Passengers waiting inside Cochin International Airport can expect a comfortable and modern environment with a range of amenities to make their waiting experience as pleasant as possible. The airport has a spacious and well-designed terminal building with separate sections for domestic and international passengers. The waiting areas are located after security and are equipped with comfortable seating arrangements, including couches, lounge chairs, and benches. There are also charging ports available at several points, allowing passengers to charge their devices while they wait. The airport has a well-designed and organized system for boarding, ensuring a smooth and efficient process for passengers. Before boarding, passengers go through a security check, where their boarding pass and identification documents are verified. Once cleared, passengers can proceed to the boarding gate, where they wait to board the flight. There are typically announcements made over the pass system to inform passengers when it's time to board. Passengers are then directed to their respective boarding gates, which are clearly marked. The airport has separate boarding gates for domestic and international flights, making it easy for passengers to find their gate. Once the boarding process is complete, passengers are directed to their seats on the plane. The airport has boarding bridges for direct access to the plane, making the boarding process easier and faster. The airport also has a designated area for disabled passengers, with wheelchair assistance available upon request. Once passengers pass through security, they can proceed to their boarding gate. Boarding usually starts with passengers requiring special assistance, followed by passengers with priority boarding status, and then by general boarding. The jet bridge is a covered walkway that connects the terminal building to the aircraft door, providing a convenient and safe way for passengers to board the aircraft. The airline staff will guide passengers to their seats on the plane and assist them with stowing their hand luggage in the overhead compartments or under the seats in front of them. Once all passengers are on board, the flight crew conducts a safety demonstration, which includes instructions on how to fasten seat belts, how to use oxygen masks, and how to use the emergency exits. Passengers are encouraged to pay attention to this demonstration as it contains important safety information. Thank you for watching and I will be back with my taking off flight from Cochin. Stay tuned.